All right, what is going on, guys? Today we are watching the One Piece live action episode six. In the last episode, the crew arrived at the Baratier, um, met Sanji. Saw as the Baratier, it looks fucking awesome in the inside. Improved vastly on what it looked like inside the anime. Like it looks more fancy, like nightclub kind of vibe in part of it. Very cool. Definitely a place I'd love to go to. Um, yeah, we met Sanji. We met, we met Zef. Sanji is his Sanji self. More flirtatious than the anime gives off, or the anime of the manga gives off, I would say. Um, I think that was a kind of direction they were going with it, though. He's going to be less pervy and more flirtatious, which is which is fine. Um, and then, uh, as well as we've met Mihawk, which is he's fucking awesome, awesome casting. Um, he wiped out the Krieg pirates. He actually killed Krieg. I didn't even realize. And Jin was literally the only survivor. Um, so that that's an interesting development. I mean, again, it's fine. It's a change that makes sense. Um, awesome. Uh, and then, yeah, we have the also the Mihawk versus Zoro Jewel. Famous Jewel did it very well. And uh, I love the Zoro's kind of I will never lose again moment. Awesome. Um, so now we have the last episode of the Bar Baratier um, where Sanji will be joining. Looking forward to it. So as always, guys, if you're new to the channel, please hit that subscribe button and like the video as well. And let's go into this episode right now. I can't did it. He's really heavy. I mean, he's got a really big head. It's like freakishly big. <laughs> Bro, he's got a normal sized head. We need a doctor. Got to get one soon. Someone needs to go back to Baradier. I'm really not hungry right now, Nami. Not for food. Maybe Damn, Luffy not hungry. Ship's doctor. I'm glad you did, but Patty sleeping off a brutal hangover, so unless you want to do brunch prep all by yourself. Oh, he's got a point there. I'm carrying to cut too thick. And I was out your way too running. Yeah. <laughs> Oregano <Oregano's> for savages. <laughs> Oh, the Konomi Islands, that's where Nami lives. Wait, and where do you think you're going? Bring me my kitchen knives and a bottle of our best whiskey. And a fresh yellow tail. And a cooler. Bigger the better. A yellow tail? Just do it already. <laughs> what is the fish for? Oh, I like the Sanji logo. God, these always hitting. What is the fish for? <laughs> this guy. Oh, he's sewing the fish onto him. Oh, no. Oh, he's... Okay, I thought he was sewing the fish onto him. What is he doing? I guess, like, the fish is going to act as, like, a plaster. Okay, yeah, I could see how that would be a thing. Fair enough. I don't know the, the medicine behind that, but sure. I like that they're going more into this, like, could Zoro not survive here kind of plotline. Nice you yeah, Mihawk just walking onto the ship. And he admits that. He's got a point. Hell yeah, Mihawk. Who knows? Maybe your grandson will be the one to find the One Piece after all. Yeah, buddy. Is this Kobe just finding out that Luffy's a grandson? Damn, he fucking wrecked the place. The poor snail. And now he's using up all that fish so it doesn't go to waste. Do you even know how to clean a sword? I guess he's just cleaning the outside. Come on, if you don't want the fish, I got two inch T-bones in the kitchen. Or uh, maybe you're in the mood for saffron risotto. I normally would get both. Oh, seeing Luffy not want to eat. The Wadaichi monkey, yeah. Why? I don't know. He said it was kind of special. It is indeed special. Can you cook 
Sora's favorite food? Sure. What does he like? Beer? Alcohol? He really likes rice balls. Mm -hmm. And beer. Can you make that? <laughs> I can make anything. Just tell me what you want. Aww. This is our Sanji man. So that he gets back his strength. After all that fighting, he must be awfully thirsty. <laughs> but, you know, he's, he's so worried about him. So Aww. So, yeah, we should, we should just let him rest. And he was one of the best pirate captains that ever sailed the seas. Seth was a pirate? Yeah. Captain of the dreaded cook pirates. We used to call him Red Leg Zeph. Red Leg Zeph. Not exactly. Oh, Sanji backstory. This will be a good one. Oh, little Sanji. This is a ship skelly. Oh shit. Actually do got blood on his boots. He no, 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 no. yeah, he's spicing up the food. Damn! Beat his ass! Oh yeah, Zeph believes too. So that's quite the time to like board a ship in the middle of like a fucking hurricane. Sunk both our ships. But, but the crew. They're all dead. What do we do? We wait. Damn! Look at the island. Oh well, this rock, I guess. I'm glad they're like adapting this part like exactly how it was. Does he still have his leg at this point? He must do. He's standing on something. Yeah, he definitely does. He didn't lose it how he did in the uh, in the anime. Or is that their ship sunken? Has he not eaten anything yet? I guess he's like really trying to sp like space it out. Bro, the sunburn you'd be get you'd get by sitting on this fucking thing all this time. At least hide in the shade, man. Seawater, gross. Twenty five days, man. Fucking hell. Oh, they don't see him. I ain't even got anything to get his to get their attention, man. Oof. Day fifty. Oh, look at him. Poor kid. Bro, 70 days? How long ago did he run out of food? And he hasn't seen Zeph all this time. You won't give me any. I'll kill him myself. Oh, look at him. Still there with his bag. You still have some food. You gotta give me some. Where is it? Where is it? Can't believe he survived all this time, man. That's fucked up. I'm glad they kept that though. You ate it. You ate your own leg. You gave me all the food. Why? You don't even know me. Why would you do that for a stranger? Oh, damn it. I'm getting emotional again. Every episode. <laughs> Damn, bro. But now my time has come to an end. You share the same dream as me. Believe me. The all blue is real. 
It's real. And, if I can't and he never gave up on it. But it might be you can. So I'm gonna need you to live on. Oh! Zeph the goat. Holy fuck. For both of us. It made him look like really skinny as well. Uh, actually, yes. <laughs> actually, I kind of do. He could have let me die on that rock. Instead, he acted like a captain. I need both arms and legs to save someone's life. Yeah, would you? I've only known him a few days. Actually, to be fair, Zeph knew Sanji for like five minutes. In a certain country in the northern seas, there was an explorer named Bon. Oh, shit. Bro, we're getting this. We're getting these stories. Bro, we better get a season two. Nolan was sentenced to death, but he continued to lie to his king, insisting the city of gold sank into the sea. Poor Nolan, man. Can you imagine that? Losing a whole city of gold? I don't think that was the point of the story. <laughs> well, he's right. I mean, why did the king have to kill him? I like how he's still got the scratches on his chest from Kuro. That's an interesting detail. Anime never keeps like scars or anything like that. Because you could have saved Zoro. He didn't have to fight Mihawk, but you let it happen. Why didn't you stop him? I didn't think he was going to lose. He could have tried to change his mind. I would never do that. So you'd rather see him like this? This is what Zoro wanted. He might die, Luffy. Anything. Except stand in the way of his dream. We all have dreams, but we outgrow them. Hell no. Nah. Is that really what you think? Don't you have a dream? Yeah, right now. It's for Zoro to not die in my bed. But isn't there something that you want? Something more. More than anything else in this world. Oh, Nami. I'm so excited. Far along park. Oh, it's going to be emotional. I'm loving these extra bits added in for Garp and Kobe this early on. I know how his mind works. So do I. What's your point? Luffy is different. He doesn't follow the rules. He thinks for himself, no matter what anyone else says. That's my fault. I was too easy on him. So it wouldn't have mattered because Luffy knows exactly what he is. Yep. Nothing can change him. I mean, he's not like going around pillaging and killing people. He's a good person still. Oh shit, is this Seeking? What is this? Oh, it's him. The Seeking. Oh no, it's not. <laughs> wow, okay, it's Arlong. Or maybe it's, uh, oh actually, I know who it might be. This is interesting. Arlong showing up at uh, the Barate. Barretier. No one leaves. Bro, I like it. I like his look. Damn, through his ass. I really like the look that they've given the fish, man. I'm glad it's not like CGI. Practical is way better in this case. Oh shit. I'm looking for a pirate in a straw hat. Maybe I might just start adding some of these nice folks to the menu. I'm liking this. He's menacing. <laughs> like the involvement of him in this arc. Being here as well is very cool. He hasn't said a word. Literally just get like a bottle of like booze and just put it under his nose. I'm guaranteed he'll wake up. Hey Zoro. What's up? <laughs> I just wanted to tell you that let me start over. Bro. I'm just gonna This reminds me of the scene that'll be coming in the future with uh when Nami was sick in bed. Luffy's trying to wake her up or get her better. You know, it's Luffy! The Harlong Pirates are at Paradier. We have to leave now. What? Why? 
Why should we leave? Because they're looking for you. Did you not hear what I just said? They are hunting you. We Nami knows what they like. I can't let innocent people get hurt because of me. Respect. Guys, Respect, Luffy. Luffy. We're gonna give them one. I love this. It's so different, but it's still exactly as the story should be. It's gonna be safe with you. Oh, and he's given her the map as well. Let's see how this is gonna go. Damn! Eating the fuck out of that meat, Arlo. Never seen a fishman enjoy a meal. That's because you don't know any fishmen. <laughs> Damn. The ones who can repair your ship or clean your house. I've nothing against your kind. Oh, yeah? Most fishmen will be happy to sit at the same table as a human. They want to be treated as equals. We all know there's nothing equal. I like the the in, in, like them including a fishman kind of waiter as well. Adds to the all long plot. I hear you're looking for me. Why, yes, I am. So this is the pirate I've heard so much about. You know, I was expecting someone bigger. So was I. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, if it was the anime, he would be bigger. <laughs> Old friend? Wait. <laughs> oh my god. Buggy's back. Burpee? Yeah. Persuaded me to point him in the right direction, which ain't easy when you don't have any hands. This guy. I've got eyes and ears everywhere. You kept an ear in his hat? How did he not notice that? Lips. Where's where's the rest of his body? <laughs> I might even let you serve in my kingdom. I don't bow down to any man. I'm no man. Or fish. Or oh, fish. Or oh, fish man. I will be. You're gonna have to fight me for it. Oh shit. Let's go, Luffy. Oh damn. Zef took a shot. Didn't even break his skin, though. Oh, no! The leg! Sanji beat his ass! Come on! Oh, shit! Oh, shit! Let's go! Oh, damn. Bro, the fight... <laughs> that was Oos up under the table already. Bro, the fighting has been great so far. I mean, we're getting walked now, but just wait. Shit. Set his ass flying. Oh my god. Oh, he looks so good. Oh, Nami. How long's lucky Zoro's not awake right now? He would chop him in half. Oh shit, he's lucky he didn't kick him into the sea. Damn! Bro, that was cool. <laughs> Bro, I'd love to see some of these, like, um, gum gun abilities in, like, 3D. I think that'd be awesome. God damn, she's pray. <laughs> Sorry. What are you doing? Tried to tell you, Luffy. Oh, she's even got the outfit on that she was wearing at the time as well. Oh, and there's the tattoo. Why waste your time killing a devil fruit eater? Let the sea do it for you. Damn. Who's here to save him? Sanji? Anyone? Zoro's not here. 
Oh, nice, Sanji. Let's go. He had time to take a shirt off, yeah? He's literally like a rock in the water. <laughs> I like that he didn't try to move at all. I mean, obviously because of his devil fruit. Damn. Luffy thinking he might lose two members in one day. He's going in. And they will be brought to justice. I thought he was going to be like, oh, we kill them. I don't need you to do that. I've got a full house tomorrow, two dinner seatings, plus practice. Enough. I don't want to hear this. What is your problem? Me. You're the one with a problem. I'm just helping you clean up now. I've already told you I'm not going to be a waiter. You're not going to be anything, not if you stay here. Mm, here it is. Life, so you could waste it abroad. Don't run this place without me. Oh, please, little eggplant. Your cooking is for shit. Yeah. It's for shit. Don't lie to him. I see what he's doing, obviously, though. Like, telling him his shit and making him want him to quit. Zeph really loves him. I love them. They're so grumpy together. Really father and son. Zoro, you need to get your ass up soon. We got a crew member to go and get. Oh. The growth we're seeing from him. Love it. He's becoming more and more serious, Luffy. Oh. Oh, he needs his first mate. You better keep talking or let me get some sleep. <laughs> of course, he just jumps right on him. Oh. May his chest relax. <laughs> At the strange stream. And left. Now, yeah, how did you know that? You've been asleep. Now it's time for me and the boys on our way to get our navigator. Roro no Azoro. Vow to stand by your side. From now until the end. Let's go. Let's fucking go, man. Let's go, Mac and you. Yeah, okay. Bro, fucking Luffy. <laughs> He's so Usopp. He's ridiculous. We can't even plot a course for the Grand Line. We need Nami. None of y'all would get to the Grand Line without her. God damn, the Mary is big. You never think about the size. Not a dry meat in these barrels. You think we brought too much? You know who you're sailing with? <laughs> True. Yeah. Mm. I heard you guys need a cook. Aw, there he is. Yes, we do! <laughs> Are we not going to get the, the Zef speech? Surely, come on. <laughs> the waiter? That's true. <laughs> Come on. We need it. Yes, here we go. 
different though. He's sailing off. Uh, Y'all need to fix that. Hey Sanji! You keep your feet dry. Goodbye, Seth. You know, all these years, living under your shitty roof, cooking at your shitty restaurant, I owe you my life. Hmm. <laughs> oh, seeing Zeph like that, come on. Thank you for putting up with my shit all these years, old man. Oh, <laughs> fuck. <laughs> I'll never forget you, Zeph. I can't resist a straw her crying. That was nice. There's, again, difference to the, the anime and the manga, but that was nice. It still hit. How do these guys even know how to get to Arlong's Island? <laughs> we're, we're going after Nami, but how are we going to find her? I know someone who does. <laughs> yeah, he kept Boogie? Alright, that's funny. This is a good development. Hello, boys! <laughs> I love this. Where's the rest of his body? Probably at Arlong Park. Right, so that was One Piece Live Action Episode 6. Once again, another fantastic episode. I really like that they're nailing these emotional moments, like in this episode, Zeph and Sanji. Zeph, honestly, was really well casted. I love the dynamic be between him and um, Sanji's actors has. So good. And uh, now we're on our way to Arlong Park. I don't actually remember how they got there originally because they can't navigate for shit. Um, the buggy kind of dynamic, number one. I'm just glad he's getting more screen time because he's great. Um, but also, like, yeah, it's a good way to actually get there because Buggy will probably have been there. Or maybe his body's there and he can kind of feel where that is. I don't know. But yeah, uh, moving on to now the next arc, Arlong Park. Two more episodes left. Very much looking forward to it. We've got Arlong Park and then we've also got Logtown, I believe, if they're going to show that. And then it's, uh, I believe, then the series will finish as we are on our way to the Grand Line. So, looking forward to it. As always, guys, I want to thank you guys so much for watching my reaction. Have an interesting day, and peace out.